In this video, we will compare CorelDRAW and Photoshop. If you guys want to get started with either CorelDRAW or Photoshop, you can use the links given down in the description. When comparing CorelDRAW and Adobe Photoshop, it's important to recognize that they serve different purposes in the graphic design landscape. CorelDRAW is primarily a vector graphic design software ideal for creating scalable graphics such as logos, illustrations, and layouts. It offers a range of tools for drawing and designing with precision, making it especially popular among print designers and those who work with large format graphics. CorelDRAW's user-friendly interface and features like the ability to create multi-page designs make it accessible for both beginners and experienced designers. Adobe Photoshop, on the other hand, is a raster-based image editing software that excels in photo editing, digital painting, and creating intricate compositions. Photoshop is the go-to choice for photographers and digital artists due to its powerful image manipulation tools and extensive features including layers, filters, and effects. While it can handle vector graphics to some extent, its strengths lie in working with pixel-based images. In my opinion, CorelDRAW is best for users focused on creating vector graphics and layouts, while Adobe Photoshop is ideal for those needing robust photo editing and raster image manipulation capabilities. Your choice will depend on whether you primarily work with vector designs or raster images. So that's a comparison between CorelDRAW and Photoshop. Make sure to use the links given down in the description to get started with either CorelDRAW or Photoshop. If this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I'll see you in the next video.